Hello friends, welcome to Java Tricky program series. So let's see what we have for today. So it's a very simple program where I have this main method and I am saying integer i equal to new integer and I am passing null. Similarly, I am saying string s is equal to new string and here also I am passing null. So what will happen here? Will it compile? If, if it doesn't compile, will it because of this line where I am trying to pass null for an integer or this line? So it's a tricky question. Why? Because it seems like that this line should throw error. Why? Because we cannot say that an integer is null, but uh, a string can be null. So let's see what is the actual issue with this program in Eclipse. So here is this program in my Eclipse and as you can see that this line is actually not throwing any error. But actually this line it is not compiling. So why it is not compiling? It seems pretty simple. We can uh, create a string as null. So let's see what is the error it is giving. So if I click on this cross it is saying that the constructor string string is ambiguous. So the reason for this is if you see the string class there are multiple constructors such as we can pass a string buffer we can pass a string we can pass a string builder also so here the java does not know whether it has to call this method with a string buffer as null or this one or this one that's why it is throwing the compiler error that the method call is ambiguous whereas in integer class there is only one method where we can pass the object string int obviously cannot be null so that's why this method it is calling this integer uh, constructor with a string as null and it is not throwing compiler error okay so the next thing is let's just comment this line so that it it works fine and what will happen if I want to print out this int value of i will it convert this null to uh, integer default value 0 or maybe throw some error let's find it out if I run this program so it is throwing number format exception the reason is the passed input is null so obviously when it is trying to convert null a string to a number it is throwing number format exception in this parse int method so hopefully this uh, short program will help you in uh, some tricky questions you find in uh, online quizzes or interview questions thank you thanks for watching bye bye